I recently got back from a media trip in Thailand called the Thailand Village Academy Competition, which was a blogger's competition. I'll be taking you around with me to show you the actual competition and also to show you my amazing village and all the wonderful things I did in the next few series of videos. My trip started off in Bangkok and then we were headed to the beautiful city of Sakotai and then back to Bangkok to see who won the competition on a week and a half long adventure. I can't wait to take you along the adventure. Let's get started. Too many hours of flying. Wow. I'm being that's really crazy right now because oh, it's just been, um, I don't even know. It's been over 24 hours of flying, but we landed in Bangkok. And it's midnight, and I can't wait to sleep. Good morning from Thailand. Wow. Hi guys, good morning from Bangkok and Thailand. I am so excited to be here. I am one of the one of the many finalists who made it for this competition that's going to be running this week. Today is July 23rd. Um, it took me two days to get here, but Basically, there's 44 contestants, 22 are international, and 22 are national, so 22 are from Thailand, and the other 22 are from other countries in the world, including me. I'm representing Israel, and um, basically, we all go to 22 different cities to see how people live. Um, we're going to small villages to see how people live on the countryside. I got to pick my destination, and I picked like a cool city with ancient ruins and stuff like that. And, there's gonna be another Thai person, Thai blogger with me on this adventure. And this is a content creating contest. So um, whoever gets the best content, I guess, um, wins a money prize award and I'm going for first place. So vote for Kim Cohen or just pray for me. Um, there's first, second, third, and fourth, and fifth place. Um, so I'm in the reception hall. There's gonna be a lot of media coming pretty soon. There's gonna be photo shoots, media, um, just a lot going on. I'll give you guys a little tour. Um, this is the reception hall, so I just checked in. I got the shirt. One second. Um, the Thailand Village Academy, and I got a little bag. And then there's coffee, and this is gonna be the reception hall. And I'll show you guys the inside, one second. So this is, I think, our like little red carpet. I feel like there's gonna be photos happening there. And they're still setting everything all up right now. A lot of moving around, but this is all the media chairs on both sides. Like It's like an award show up in here. Um, I do see my chair. So then the bloggers with the countries. My chair is over there, little Israel. Okay, I think we have an issue. So I had to go change into my shirt and grab my laptop and I can't find my computer's charger. What? I don't understand. I'm just praying and hoping that it's in my house. But I'm also praying and hoping that it magically appears in one of my bags, which is not happening right now, but I need it to. Are you fucking kidding my life? I need my laptop to win this competition. <coughs> this is not okay. Okay, so now all the media is here and things are crazy. And there's so many people inside. Um, yeah, there's a lot going on. For sure. Things just started to get really crazy and overwhelming and I felt like I was on some Thai TV show and in a way I kind of was. We were all over the news and all over the media in Thailand. All 44 finalists and representatives from the villages to the After the competition, me and a couple of the bloggers girls went out for a night of fun. How many people do you guys think you can fit into the back of a taxi? 
We got five people <laughs> And I think we could fit another one like so, right between right us. Here. Yeah. <laughs> maybe even <Flying> two. <laughs> maybe even two. <laughs> so seven people in one taxi. It's a small taxi. Okay, so we are getting a Thai class from this one over here. That one. She knows fluent. She's amazing. So we learn Kampung Thai. Did I say right? Kampung Thai. Thank you. But say it the dramatic way. That means like, that's like being extra polite. Chai. Chai means yes. And how do you say no? My chai. 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 Not into it. We're at a restaurant that has a library like Harry Potter, and she's gonna show me that it gets better. Which, so much detail. Oh, 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 stop it! Wow! Ooh! Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh my god, look at these potions. I like this music. It was raining really crazy, so we don't know. I feel like half of it's already closed, but we will see. Wait, I just saw my first lady boy um, bar thing. I'm kind of shocked. I'm shocked. I've been to drag queen places, things before, but this is this is wild. It's like the normal to you. The translation of the place is bar with vaginas. What? Mm. They're wearing like lady nightgowns and hot pink. But they're all muscly. But they're all muscular. They're ripped. And they're wearing like a bra and pants. I thought that was a person. <laughs> <laughs> I swear. I'm losing it. Wait, can I zoom in? Can you see it? She's blocking. Oh, damn it. It's like, it's wild. Okay, new spot. We're going to Tipsy. They have live music, which we guess we do. I think that's one of my favorite things about Thailand. They always have live music. And people are so freaking good. That's it for my first day in Bangkok. Make sure to come back soon to see the next video of my village. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day. And don't forget to give this a thumbs up. Love you.